to our dearly beloved. Sometimes we experience and words are not enough. And that is why we are looking for something that we can hold on to. And I think the gospel for this evening gives us the kind of encouragement that we have to continue what our sister Teresine had started. And do not let your hearts be troubled. Continue having faith in God and faith in Jesus. That in His providence, we have to look at it, everything that happened within the eyes of faith. Probably to some of you, you have been very close to our sister Teresa. Some of you have been devotees of Our Lady of Mediatrics. Some of you have been going on as a pilgrims to Lipa. We have common denominator and that common denominator of ours is that all of us are devotees of the Blessed Mother. Yun ang pagkakaisa natin lahat kasama natin si Sister Teresa. At yun ay isang biyaya na ipinagkakaloob ng Diyos Ama sa atin. To be a devotee of the Blessed Mother is a charism. It is a grace that we have to be grateful for. And that is why if Sister Teresa has been gifted with a kind of devotion to our Blessed Mother, there is a reason for us to be grateful for in spite of our bereavement. Kaya tayo ngayon dito, kahit pa paano, sa isang banda malungkot, pero sa isang banda, tayo rin ay napapasalamat sa banal na Eucharistia.